a road game for the Kings, and they're facing an interconference matchup in today's game. 2K Sports brings you Friday night NBA action. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Steve Kerr. On the sideline tonight, Doris Burke. And the injury to Mo Harkins. This really is the big news here. Kevin, you could tell when he went down in the last game that it wasn't good. And that news just confirms our worst fear. You're going to have to watch from the sideline, and I'm not sure how long he's going to be. Well, we'll see. I mean, as his rehab progresses, we'll get a better idea of that. But it has to be a very emotional time for him right now, Clark. You know, as a player, you grit your teeth when you're getting that kind of a diagnosis, but it's a tough fate to accept. We've got a chance here to set the floor, courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up and ready to go for this one. On the court for Sacramento, Landry and Cousins patrol the paint. Stauskas is the two with Gay playing small folk, and it's the general in at the point. Now here's Peyton. Oladipo dishes to Vucevic. Sacramento grabs the miss. Their last game, a win against San Antonio, looking to carry that into this one. You know, their percentage from long range that game was off the charts. It seemed like every time the home crowd got going, they just took the wind out of their sails with a, another three-point barrage. Yeah, those bombs were really fall. that has unfortunately come up for this Orlando franchise is their inability to keep franchise talent for long. Of course, you think both about Shaq and Dwight Howard and their exits. Now here's Vucevic. He's coming off a 13-point game against Phoenix. And don't forget about the incredible rebound tonight for him, too. And just devouring the glass all game long. Game with it. I think Doris Burke has something for us right now. Doris? Thank you, Kevin. The Magic head coach and I had a chance to talk just for a bit. He told me he's wary about how they'll contend with DeMarcus Cousins inside. He said he's a beast in there, no doubt about it. Size, length, strength, and a ton of skill. The talent is really off the charts with him. And guys, he knows it won't be easy to muscle Cousins away from the rim, but he said that's what they've got to find a way to do. It won't be easy. Thanks a lot, Doris. The Kings have gone two or three here to start out the game. Gay outside the dish to Cousins. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. He misses the free throw. Good on the second free throw. Now about two minutes gone here in the first quarter. Peyton drives in, past the front. Peyton kicks to Oladipo. Magic moving the ball around. And the basket by Karasov. Karasov's got five points so far. Orlando on D. Last game matchup with the Suns. A, a tough loss there. Yeah, you want to talk about a team that just couldn't get into a rhythm offensively. That was a really ugly game for them. Yeah, you know what? I wonder about the game plan, but really, it was more about a lack of execution than anything else. The Magic have gone three of five shooting the ball so far. Peyton passes to Oladipo. Karasov dishes to Peyton. Pass to Fry. He kicks it to Oladipo. Just three to shoot. From the wing. Offensive rebound. Out of bounds. Sacramento will take possession. And let's quickly check out the best young defenders, how they've been playing in the low post lately. Your rookie block leaders for the past month. Take a look at the general, one of the top intimidators in the league, a fierce shot block. Boy, is he tough on the inside, guys. It's been a really good stretch for him uh, defensively. Yeah, I like his swagger for a rookie. I mean, he wants guys bringing the ball inside on him so he can show them what he's got in there. And Oladipo kicks the fry. Back to Oladipo. He feeds it to Karasov. Back to 
Oladipo. Let's it fly. Off the left rim and up. For Sacramento, they've gone four of five from the field so far. Staskis again, Sacramento. The Magic Trail by four. Nick Stauskas was born in Ontario, Canada, seven days after the NBA awarded Toronto an expansion franchise. Nice little factoid there. When he was 10 at a Raptors open practice, he got called down to play some two-on-two against Vince Carter. And Stauskas buried a three on him. Now he's an NBA player himself. Man, that's a heck of a turnaround in about 10 years. Here's the general. 35 points for him last game against San Antonio. And his work on the glass, certainly noteworthy. And he contributed in a number of ways. And a missed opportunity right there. Definitely, I think he should have converted that one. Oladipo, the best to beat. And that one's good. And Stauskas Clark, part of this vanguard of Canadian talent, never played hockey. Basketball has always been his game. You know, but he grew up at a time when Canadian hoops culture wasn't exactly thriving. I mean, during the seventh and eighth grade years, his team had no coach, so he coached the team, calling plays and making substitutions. You can see evidence of that in how he plays. He's pretty cerebral in addition to being Thompson's checked in. The Kings leading. The general passes to Stauskas. Here's the general. Gets the three-pointer to fall. The general's got his third bucket of the night. Orlando's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Oladipo with the ball. He's had some playing time, but no scoring yet from him. Peyton kicks to Vucevic. That's good. And it's Peyton with the assist. Peyton's got three assists now in this one. Kings leading now by three. It's Gay on the way. Help the bucket. You know, something we're seeing less and less of these days, that little finger roll. Orlando, they've gotten five of ten shots to drop in this game so far. Right at the 50% mark. Peyton kicks to Oladipo. Peyton drives in. The kick out to Oladipo. Just five on the clock. And the rejection by Cousins. Kicks to Thompson. And the pass to the general. Pulls up on the wing. Goes back up. It's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. Yeah, the defender draped all over. Pretty plain and simple. Got him good there. And some stats here, guys. The scoring breakdown for the King. And the points they're getting in the lane will really help them open up. Nice shooting. Points early on coming off assist. Catching up on the changes for Orlando. Channing Fries. For Fry. Victor Oladipo comes in for Karzov. And it's Peyton in for Luke Ridnock. Peyton at the one with Oladipo by his side at the two. Gordon and Vucevic, the big men inside. And it's Gordon in at the three, the small forward. That's his out there for Orlando. Here's the general. He has seven. Here's Stauskas. Rebounded by Vucevic. Vucevic has got his fifth rebound right now in the game. And finished off by Oladipo. Beautiful feed off the bounce to his teammate there. Nicely done. Sacramento's gone 0-2 from deep in the second. Now let's go to Doris Burke, Doris. Thank you, Kevin. Alfred Payton has some very noticeable hair on the floor. He said the story behind it is as follows. Me and my teammates in high school agreed we wouldn't cut our hair the entire season until we won a state championship. We wound up losing in the semifinals, but I liked what it was doing and just let it keep growing and growing. Guys, will it ever end? 
We'll see if it does. Thanks, Doris. Guys back and forth this first half. Well, five lead changes early on, guys, as we grapple back and forth. Yeah, this could be a, a back and forth game all the way, guys, the way it's being played. This is fun to watch. Now, here's Oladipo. He's coming off the 19-point game against Phoenix. And he played great at the defensive end of the floor, too. Kevin had a couple of important block shots in that game. So, good all-around effort. Here's the general following the bucket by Orlando. That's good. Orlando, they've gone 4 of 8 so far here in the second quarter. Vucevic dishes to Oladipo. Here's the screen. Gordon with no one around. And again, it's Orlando with the three. And the lead goes right back over. This is a seesaw affair. The game's there for the taking, but neither team seems to want it. Here's the general. And again, it's Sacramento converting. And he was one step ahead of the defense when he fired that pass for the assist. Orlando's gone three of seven tonight from three-point territory. Vucevic setting the pick for Oladipo. Payton drives in. Vucevic, that's in, coming off an assist from Payton. Payton's got assist number five here tonight. You know, of the last six baskets, five have come on the interior. This is major smash-mouth basketball, guys. Love it. Old school. Physical play in the paint. Dominate. Payton, right side. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Peyton's got his second basket of the game. The Kings trailed by four. Here's the general. 11 points in the game. This is it to Stauskas. He's looking for Cousins and finds him. Six to shoot. And he sinks it from deep. Three-pointer good from the general. The general's got seven points for the quarter. The Magic have gone 7 of 11 from the field in the second quarter. Peyton outside. Dishes it to Oladipo. Toward the pass to Vucevic. Here's McCallum. He's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. The shot's good from the general. Well, the defense not doing a good job at all of getting after him. They've got to crowd him and make it tough for him. That's his second this quarter. And Oladipo kicks to Gordon. Peyton outside. Feeds it to Gordon. Gordon with the screen for Gordon. The kick out to Oladipo. Six on the shot clock. Goes up to the strike. Misses off the right iron. You know, that mid-range jump shot is not his strong suit, even when he gets a good look like that. Here's the general, and another three for Sacramento. Well, as long as the threes keep dropping for him, he'll continue firing away. And they are dropping for him. What a game he's having from deep. for Sacramento. Jason Thompson is checked in for Landry. And Rudy Gay is subbed in for Stauskas. Doris Burke has an update for us. Doris? Their plan was to run their offense through Gay. Coach has a lot of faith in him offensively and let his players know it, insisting that he be at the forefront of what they do at that end of the court from here on out. So, Kevin, changes already being made on the fly here in the second Order. Thank you, Doris. It's deflected. It's stolen by Oladipo. Here's Peyton. And the layup's good off the glass. Peyton. He's got eight points. Another bucket in the paint. That's something they just have not been able to stop today. I think it's time to make some adjustments defensively, Clark. I mean, what they've got going right now is not getting it done. Victor Oladipo plays the same college coach as Dwayne Wade. And, you know, their games actually draw some comparisons. Both are 6'4", strong, huge wingspans, and explosive athletes with that ball handling ability. I think Oladipo has a great future. 
and Oladipo, an all-around player. He can rebound, pass, and he can defend, even block shots. Yeah, and again, you see the parallels with Dwayne Wade, although not as tall, not quite as long as Wade. His charisma and passion, though, remind you a bit of Dwayne Wade in terms of his game. And I like his name, too. Oladipo. I That's do, nice too. I like that shooting. Well, oh, there you go. <laughs> Catching up on the changes for Orlando. Channing Fries checked in for Vucevic. Karzov comes in for Ben. And that'll do it for the first half. Game time. And don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of the third quarter. Okay, guys. Let's focus and get down to business. Now, here's a few things I took away from the first half. Well, both sides have assessed what they need to do over the break in halftime. Just a pleasure to watch him play basketball. The way he sets up his teammates, his passing, his decision making, very impressive. Yeah, Steve, everything has been running through him, and he's doing a really nice job of racking up those assists. On the court right now for the Kings, Landry and Cousins patrol the paint. Stauskas is the two with Gabe playing small folk, and it's the general in at the one spot. No matter what they've tried, the D just has not been able to deny them the ball in the paint. That's been so critical, Clark, because whenever they have gotten the ball into the paint, it's resulted in points, it seems like. Hey, good. Brought back the finger roll. That's a nice finesse move to pull off with the defense all over. The general passes to Landry. The Kings have made two and missed two at the line tonight. And their success rate from the stripe this season, 77%. And he sinks the second. I thought the pressure might get to him a little bit, but he did enough to put them in front. For the lead, and again, it's Orlando converting. And Clark, a great competitive game so far. Yeah, tit for tat. I mean, back and forth, plenty of lead changes, an excellent play. These two teams, guys, look so evenly matched to me. I think this could go right down to the wire. Good ball movement here by the Kings. Back to game. Shot clock at six. Gets it to go from 18 feet away. Okay, he's got 15 points. And after that last game, Clark, I'm not surprised to see him so hot. He's got it rolling right now. Peyton outside. The feed now to Oladipo. Karasov dishes to Oladipo. Another miss by Oladipo. I'll tell you what, for what's really a, an elementary shot, he looks a little nervous on that release. He is an automatic finisher when he gets into that area. You know, he picks the simple one-handed stuff to get the two points. So those could be an important two points, too, guys, in a close game like this one. Pretty good defense there. I mean, that's a shot that he can make, but they really challenged him. Coach is liking Clark what he's seeing from his offense. And too, why wouldn't he? I mean, guys, they're filling it up with ease, executing, getting quality shots. I mean, this is fun to watch. Yeah, this is like a clinic out there, guys. This is exactly how you attack a defense. Move the ball, sharp cuts, really a nice pace to their offense. Sacramento leading by five. The general passes to Stauskas. Here's the general. Banked in off the glass. The general's got 24. They're rolling now. Five straight hoops to start this quarter. Magic have gone two of five, shooting here in the third quarter. Vucevic setting the pick for Oladipo. Out to the right wing. And Karnasov picks to Vucevic. Four on three as they bring it up. Right wing. Here's the general chance to extend the lead to double digits but it's no good. The Magic trailed by seven. Out to the wing. Will it go? So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. Obvious foul. Yeah, he took a hit right there and earned those free throws. The Magic shooting their fourth and fifth attempts at the free throw line tonight and he makes the first. Gordon's checked in for Orlando.
And he makes the first, but misses the second. Sacramento leading by six. Ring shot on the way. And again, it's Sacramento converting. And yeah, they're moving the ball now. Eight of their last 10 points coming off assisted buckets. Steve, nothing makes a coach smile as much as pure selfless teamwork. Shot goes down. Very good possession right there. Gordon's got five now. You know, he was smart to draw his man out to the perimeter. He's giving up too much size to be effective. As long as he picks his spots, his outside shot will be hard to block, no matter who's on it. The general passes to Stauskas. He dishes it to Gay. Pass to the general. Three-pointer. No good. The Magic go the other way with it. He's really slowed down a bit here in the second half. He hasn't converted a three yet after the tremendous first half he had. Oladipo, good. Here's the general. 24 points for him. Well, quite an interesting upbringing for Victor Oladipo. His mother and father immigrated from Nigeria. They ingrained a great work ethic in their children. But his father in particular didn't really approve of his son's focus on basketball. But Victor was undeterred. Got a piece of it. Stauskas, the pass to the general. Gate kicks to Cousins. A jump hook, and that one's good. Cousins has got his second basket of the night. And taking a quick look here at the hustle stats for Sacramento. Boy, defensively, they've played with a high energy level, guys, and all the steals we've seen, really a result of that aggressiveness. Another factor here tonight has been the amount of points they've scored off turnovers. And foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line and shoot two. How about the game for Oladipo? He's got eight points and four assists. The Magic have made three of their first five foul shots tonight. The first free throw is good ball movement. Bar is off. Sacramento also making some changes. Wake up, son. You're in. Oh, it's time to ball. Puts up a prayer. No good. And as we conclude the third quarter. Tune in Friday, March 7th. DeMarcus Cousins and the Sacramento Kings go on the road. In a moment now to check out our State Farm assist to the game. And what a by a talented point guard. Well, this is what he does. This is the kind of plays he's known for, Kevin. The Magic trailed by three. We've got Karasov. Ridnow are out there with Peyton. And there's Gordon. And it's Fry in at the center locking down the middle. This is out there for Orlando. Peyton outside. Deflects the pass. And up the court come the Kings on the break. And so it looks like the Kings will retain possession here. Maybe a low percentage pass, but it, it still nearly got through. I like it, though. I mean, it's an aggressive play. Heads up defending to deflect it away. A shot's good from the general. He just is not missing today. What a day he's had from the field. I think he, he's the guy who's kept him in this game with his performance at that end of the court. Peyton dishes to front. Gordon with a screen on top. Out to the wing. Karasov passes to Gordon. Pocket six. Rittenauer against Thompson. Pulls up. High post. Out that one. And the Kings lead has been cut down to three points on the bucket from Rittenauer. And now both of these clubs are really in a groove here. Already a high scoring game, but it has become an offensive showcase down the stretch. Ties a three. It's hauled in by Fry. The Magic shooting one of the high points for them in this game at 54%. And Orlando again with the bucket. Superb assist there. He played the role of the maestro on that one. Here's the general. Orlando grabs the miss. He's far too tentative in the paint. And even more so when the defender is up tight on him like that time. Peyton outside. And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. You 
cannot afford to make mistakes like that here in a tight game. Well, an illegal screen is one of the toughest calls for the official to make. You know, I agree with you. You've got to have some sympathy for the referees when they have to make calls like that, but they get paid well, and they're the best in the business, so they can handle it. The Magic making a switch here. Vucevic has checked in. Demarcus Cousins, he's checked in for Sacramento. A comes in for Jason Terry. Ridenauer's shot is off. Easy look there, but, you know, he misses those once in a while. Payton kicks the fry. Picked by Vucevic. There's the dish to fry. Back to Payton. And fry kicks to Carson. Vucevic trying to get over. Once again off the mark, Orlando. The Kings have gone one of four since the end of the third quarter. And Rudy Gay with the three. Gay's got 20 points. Great idea to pull up and take the transition three there. The D was in position to block his path to the hoop if he took it inside. Peyton drives in. Here's now The offensive rebound. And it's Vucevic missing. Kings leading now by four. A baseline J. And it's Orlando with the rebound. Fry's got six rebounds here tonight. Things have kind of gone south for him here in the quarter. Karzov dishes to Ridenauer. Here's Peyton. Landry grabs the miss. Landry's got his third rebound on the night. Cousins with a screen on Ridden. The general passes to Cousins. Soft touch off the glass. And what jumps out at you guys, the assist totals. I mean, they have been dominant in that category. It's the ball movement, the player movement, great rhythm to their offense. Clearly seems to me a different mindset between these teams. And Orlando making a change here. Okay. Let's go quickly over to Doris Burke for an update. Hey, Kevin, during that last break, I heard Orlando's coach as he addressed his team. He let his players know that they've got to do a better job on defense. He said they're scoring any way they want. We've got to show some pride here. Let's make a stand defensively, get a stop, and get on a run of our own. Do they have it in them, Kevin? Thank you, Doris. Here's Fry, buried from 15 feet out. You know, as soon as he got an opening, he let it fly. That was a big shot there. Kings leading now by four. The general passes to Gay. Here's the general. Now here's Gay. No good on the shot, a bit long that time. Boy, he should have made that one. He had plenty of cushion between himself and the defender. What a smooth finish. Well, he's certainly the one they want on the end of those breaks. He always finishes strong. Here's the general. Andrea screen on Peyton. The general passes to Landry. Here's the general, covered by Peyton. Shot clock at five. Here's Stauskas, and it's good. The time running down on the shot clock. And the Kings lead by four. Magic have gotten just under 45% of their attempts to drop in the fourth or of nine. There's the pick, and Oladipo kicks to front. Oladipo dishes to Vucevic, pass to Fry, shot clock at six. The high post shot, that's good on the jump shot. Really good execution there, guys. They saw the mismatch, and they went right at it. Timely bucket. Couldn't have been a better opportunity. Shoots from 14 again, Sacramento. You know, there's no better sign of how efficiently a team is operating than their assist number. And theirs are fantastic. It's just beautiful basketball to watch, Clark. Peyton hits to Oladipo. Peyton outside. And off the left side of the rim, and it swirls in for him. Feels like a flip has been switched at halftime because both teams now really getting after it. Man, it's been a fun half of basketball, Steve. 
Here's the general again, Sacramento. Uh, you got to like his shot selection today. He set a good example for the rest of his teammates. Peyton outside. He kicks to Vucevic. Sacramento grabs the miss. The Generals got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. From deep, there's the bucket. Good. And it's a seven-point Kings lead. His work at the offensive end has been phenomenal. Maybe he's in number one. They're ahead. Two left in the fourth quarter. And Oladipo kicks to Vucevic. Here's the general, covered by Peyton. No good from the general. Orlando, they've gone 6 of 12 from the field here in the fourth, and even 50%. Oladipo against Cousins. Let's it go from 14. Oladipo misses. Kings leading now by seven. Here's the general. That misses off the back foot. The Magic shooting at a 46% clip in the fourth quarter. Here's Peyton. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. Peyton's got four points now in the quarter. They're not as aggressive from the outside here. Maybe they should think about stretching the defense a little bit, like they did in the first half. I mean, stretching the defense makes it easier to score inside, too. Shoots a three. Rebounded by Vucevic. Looks like he's just trying to shoot his way out of this cold spell, but uh, I don't know about that shot. Big time bucket there, Clark. And Kevin, the crowd is loving it. Well, they know exactly how big that shot was. Guys, they're not going to be in any rush on this possession. Not with the lead. I mean, now's the time to use the clock to your advantage. Take your time. Milk the clock a little bit. Here's the general. It's in! Screenplay worked ideally there, and I'm not talking about the screenplay you see in a movie theater. <laughs> Gave him more than enough room to get that shot off. Now, here's Oldie. He's covered closely. Good! What a beautiful shot to bring him to within three. 15 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And they foul intentionally. They're going to have to do that now again and again. They're not in the penalty yet. That's right. No other option but to foul and hope for some misses. Yep, you got to extend the game here. Try to keep that clock from moving. Out of bounds, Orlando takes possession. You know, sometimes the intensity of the game can lead to brain-neutral plays like that, guys. Peyton passes to front. From three point territory, and that's an intentional foul. Third on the first, and that gives them a four point cushion. And he hits both free throws here, so now it's a five point game. That may be the knockout blow, guys. Those free throws would seem to have put this one away. Jacks up a three, can't get it to go. So it's Sacramento picking up the win. They pulled off this win, Clark, with respectable performances. Gentlemen, I'm here with DeMarcus Cousins. And DeMarcus, tell us what the team did tonight that made you guys so effective. My, someone called the National Weather Service. We had an unanticipated storm in the building. Like, homeboy was raining threes down on those fools. Bam, bam, bam. One after another. They lose track of you and boom, another. That was so sweet to see. You keep shooting like that, it's gonna make a huge difference for us.
Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Don't give me that all short thing now, not after a game like that. Hey, I'm just trying to help the team win, bro. You did a good job. Thanks, dog. Thank you.